Imagine you could seamlessly fade out a moving object in your video. With Hide from ProDat, this is no problem at all. Let me show you what to do. The object needs to be tracked and the mask should look like this. Let's start from scratch. We start a new project and import the video clip. Second step. You may trim the clip by setting the desired start and end position. Click on Activate Workspace and the workspace will be set to the length of your clip. Third step, processing the snowboarder. Please choose the rectangular mask form and draw the mask over the object. Activate the mask and adjust the orientation and size of the mask over the entire length of the clip. But for tracking like this, there is even a better way. Click on the red button to activate the mouse tracking method. By moving your mouse, you now move the mask accordingly. Pressing the key N or B on your keyboard, you move forth or back frame by frame. Pressing the cursor keys, you adjust the rotation and size of your mask. Having reached the end of the clip, we now work on the remaining frames up to the beginning. Press any mouse button to end the mouse tracking mode. Fourth step, enhancing the mask. The snowboarder must be completely covered by the mask during the entire clip. To check the mask, we skip through the timeline and whenever the mask is off, please adjust the size or position. Height will automatically set a keyframe and save your changes. Holding the shift key while pressing the cursor keys, you may adjust the width or length separately. Fifth step, click on view result and now let's check how the snow border is going to disappear. The yellow line shows frames that have already been cached for preview. Sixth step. Now let's apply our special video effect that will amaze your viewers. We will slowly fade out the snow border from our scene. To do so, we choose the position to begin our fade and activate the keyframes for opacity. We start with 100% because the snow border should be completely visible. Then we look for the moment when we want him to be disappeared. Add another keyframe and set the opacity to 0%. The fading effect looks great and we achieved within the shortest time what would not have been possible with any other solution than height. We have prepared more height tutorials for you have fun and enjoy your work with Hyde.